Good afternoon, my friends. I am Mrs. Baggett. I am your principal. For those of you who don't know me, I want to welcome you to the Principal's Corner. And this is where I will be reading books to you that I feel are culturally relevant. And I wanna make sure that we are working to connect with one another. So I thought this would be the best way to make sure that you learn a little bit about each other and sometimes about yourself. These books are available in our school library. So make sure when you get an opportunity to check out the books that I share with you. So our first book that I'm sharing today is called Fry Bread. And this book is relevant because it connects us all together. In different cultures, we eat fry bread. So let's learn a little bit more. This is Fry Bread, a Native American family story. And this is written by Kevin Noble, Maillard, illustrated by Juana Martinez Neal. Again, fry bread. And this book won an award, so you should check it out. Fry bread is food, flour, salt, water, cornmeal, baking powder, perhaps milk, maybe sugar all mixed together in a bowl, in a big bowl. Fry bread is shape. Hands mold the dough, flat like a pancake, round like a ball, or puffy like Nana's softest pillow. My grandkids call me Nana, so I love that part. So take a look. Fry bread is sound. The skillet clangs on the stove. The fire blazes from below. Drop the dough in the skillet. The bubbles sizzle and pop. I love these illustrations. You can see it sizzling in the pan. And actually I can see the smell wafting up over into this kid's nose. And this one loves the sound. Fry bread is color, golden brown, tan, or yellow, deep like coffee, sienna, or earth, light like snow and cream, warm like rays of sun. Oh, expressing that as different colors, like you guys, like all of you and all of us. Fry bread is flavor, see beans or soup. Smell tacos, cheese, and vegetables. Delight in honey and jam. Rise to discover what brings us together. Mm. Are you hungry yet? Fry bread is time. On weekdays and holidays, supper or dinner, powwows and festivals, moments together with family and friends. Fry bread is art, sculpture, landscape, portrait, our daily craft, shared from teacher to student, a cycle of heritage and fortune. And when they say teacher to student, they're not just talking about your teachers at school, they're talking about your parents at home and your other family members who teach you thing about things about your culture or your heritage. Fried bread is history, the long walk, the stolen land, strangers in our own world with unknown food. We made new recipes from what we had. And remember, this is a Native American story. If you take a look here, you see birds and different animals and people walking. You learn more about that as you get older in the older, grader, older grades classrooms. Fry bread is place, Alaska, Kansas, all the way to Maine, down to Delaware, on to Georgia, over to Oklahoma, Colorado, and California, cities and lands we call home. So Native Americans 
traveled over great distances. Fry bread is nation. Abenaki, Apache, Arapaho, Ojuwebe, Onogaga, Oglala, Sioux, Narragansett, Navajo, Nipmuc, Seminole, Shoshone, Sac, and Fox, hundreds and hundreds of tribes. Fry bread is everything, round, flat, large, small, north, south, east, west, brown, yellow, black, white, familiar and foreign, old and new, we come together. Fry bread is us. We are still here, elder and young, friend and neighbor. We strengthen each other to learn, change, and survive. Fry bread is you. So in the back of this book, there is a recipe for fry bread. How will you make it? And I love the fact that there's an author's note that talks about the different cultures that actually make fry bread and how they're connected to one another. And it's about our Native American people. And really, if you think about it, there is, there's tribes and people throughout the United States that are culturally related to this. And it's a focus on our indigenous people. And that means that they are native to these lands meaning they were born here, they're the original people of what before it was called the United States. So you'll learn so much more. So check out this book when you get a chance. Remember, it is called Fry Bread. Thank you for listening and make sure you come back soon.